Why do menaces like this end up with awesome powers? Why not someone like you, Jonah? <laughs> well, I have considered trying to use advanced science to give me powers, only so I could protect you in a more hands-on way, of course. But after much reflection, I've decided against it. Because power corrupts. I'm a man of the people, and I want to stay one of the hard-working, ordinary people of New York. So I'll just help via my talk show, my publishing empire, and my vast personal fortune. No need to thank me. It's what a man of the people does. That's cool, Jonah, but can I get back to uh, taking these guys down stealthily? Because I'm just trying to get a couple crime tokens. Hello everyone, I am the game here and welcome to more Marvel Spider-Man. In the last episode, we played a really dumb game of hide and seek. And this one, we're going to start by taking on some, uh, you, you know the drill at this point. We're taking on a stable outpost, then we're going to do some Taskmaster boxes, and then we're going to do the story mission. So, first things first, what are our missions? Wait, Yuri. Tell me about this place. Yuri. Looks like some people were protesting this Sable base, and the agents responded by locking them up. Great way to win hearts and minds. Can you get them out? It'll take some persuasion, but I'm a pretty persuasive guy. Throw five jetpack enemies doing aerial comp. Oh, you a bitch. Game. Whatever. Oh great, snipers. Oh, they're in the nice little towers. Let's tear those down. Is there another tower? I'm gonna assume that's the only one. I'm just gonna keep pulling. Okay, now we just have to worry about the jetpacks. And there's no jetpack. God, there's so many of the people wanting to shoot me. Can't you guys just play fair and try and hit me in the face like everyone else? God, there's all... It's guns and batons everywhere. I was being shot from three directions. God, there's so many guns. I think you guys are hired mercenaries, but can you dial it back on the guns? I think you got a little bit too many. Did I lose my combo? How? Ugh. Please stop opening fire. Like, I'm really sick of guns. Hey, right, look. I really hope that wasn't one of the aerial guys. Okay, that was pretty cool. I'm I'm a little focused. Oh, no jetpack guy. Throw you. Oh, does that not count because I wasn't in the air? That BS. Well, that's a good note for you, the Watcher. Uh, if you see a flying guy... Competition to maintain a positive work environment. 
can we get some nice, pleasant, not this. I wonder what the bounty on me is. I wasn't even thinking about this. Like, how much is Spider-Man worth? I'll be honest, I'm gonna say at least a hundred. <laughs> but I hope it's more. There's a fly guy over there. That's three. The aim with flying guys. Well, you're not flying anymore. And you are 100% grounded. Oh, there's one. Whoa! Down you go. I hope there's at least one more guy flying. Okay, that didn't work as planned. This is actually a very efficient way to take these guys out, if I do say so. If I can say so, I didn't actually. Ne I never actually thought about doing this. That or just using a finisher, because finisher is definitely the easiest way to take them down. Any anyone else in the air? No. Good. Um, what happened? I think I missed. I only get untouchable one. I've been doing so many dodges. There was a rocket. Excuse me. I specifically said no rockets. God, there's two rocket guys. Cease. This tomfoolery. I just I just did the neck breaker on both those guys. Is that the last of them? That was harder than it should have been. Yeah. Well it was only harder because I was trying to do the stupid bonus thing. You're free to go. You all made parole. Woo! Got the people out of the cells. They don't seem inclined to continue their protest. I hate that Sable's violating constitutional rights, but right now, I'll settle for keeping innocent people out of lockup. Thanks. Nice. Alright. Yeah, I really wish I had switched the order and I, in which I was going to so, show these two suits, but hey, too late now. Because we're going to see two suits this episode. Alright, time for some Taskmaster stuff and the... Last couple Taskmaster things are down here. We'll do the bombs and the drone. Oh, who is discording me? This is not a Discord time. This is a... Uh... This is a Spider-Man time. Spider-Man hiding on the outside time. Alright. Which one? Let's do the bomb first. I feel like it's been a while since we've done a bomb. I'm sure this one will be a blast. Pause for a laugh. Oops. Overshot it. Alright, let's do this. This one's over there. Come on. Let's get going.
I'm in very focused this episode. I will... Like, I, I don't know why I've been so focused. I've been, like, in a zone. Like, I don't want to talk because I'm like, oh my god, I'm doing so well. But, I'm but like, that's part of the thing I'm supposed to do. Like, it's... Half of this is being good at games, half of this is uh, talking while being good at games. It's a 50-50 split. Wow, that was only silver. I thought I did pretty good. I'm fine with the silver though. Let's go do a drone challenge. Now it's time to really do badly. That was that was like just okay. This is going to be terrible. God, can you all stop shooting at me? All right. Let's go get our second Taskmaster box. All right. There, I see it. There's one, two, three, four. My voice cracked, but that's besides the point. Five. Six, seven. God damn it, I was doing so well too. Got one. Now I can catch the drone. They actually do good on the Wow! I did bad on the I did bad on the bomb challenge and good on the drone challenge. That's a rare one for me. All right, let's show off a different suit. The 29.9 white suit. I actually really, can I just say real quick, while, while we're on this, I don't really like the 29.9 white suit because I really like the way the original 29.9 looks. There's something about this one that I don't like. It looks overly edgy. Like this is edgy, but it still looks all right. This one looks overly edgy. It also looks nothing Spider-Man. There's nothing that I could say. Because the logo looks less like a spider than the other one. It looks far more like a skull, but like part with a jacked up jaw. But that's just me. Let's go do our... I'm, I'm just going to fast travel. I'm, I'm getting into the habit of fast traveling more. Let's go do our uh, our story mission. Oh, my neck is itching. Peter's gotta get sleep in what he can. I'm gonna go around this sable base. Cause we, we already did our sable outpost for the episode. Thank you. I know I should have done. I should have done the Taskmaster boxes first, then the Sable base. Too late now. Calling agents in Manhattanville, requesting an update right. on your status. Let's go stop Rhino. He's he's wrecked a little too many things. What part? Why do you guys always think the guns will work against this guy? When have they ever worked? Pick on someone your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, folk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Rhino, what's with the team? Huh. You were a loner. So Rhino. 
So Rhino is a bit too big to hit head on. You have to stun him first. And the best way to stun him is by hitting him with something bigger than he is. You can throw like little things at him, but they won't do much. Come here, big guy. There we go. Try a new ability. Got him. Okay, Rhino. Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Scorpion, I'm glad you showed up. I got a bone to pick. What were you gonna do if I didn't show up? Beg him to give up? Like an old fairy couple, you two. Let's get some good hits on Scorpion while he's stunned. Oh, let's see if we can. Can we drop this on Rhino? Yes. So you, this is probably the hardest fight in the game, in my opinion. It's a very grounded fight against Scorpion and Rhino, and both of them are really tough on their own. But what makes them especially tough is fighting them together. Whoa! Where, where's Scorpion? I want... It's a little hard. I can't even see where Scorpion is. There he is. Let's even him out of the air. Trying to get... Maybe if I can hit... Oh, got hit by Rhino. This is the hardest fight just because it's really hard to keep track of two big hitters. Alright, let's try and stay in the air to avoid Rhino and see if we can get Scorpion first. If I can find Scorpion. There we go. Oh! I'm so glad I was doing a finisher at that time. I'm glad I had some healing. Let's hit Rhino a bit. Crap, crap! There is a lot going on here. The good part is you can get them to hit each other. God damn it. These two could be easy or hard. It depends. There we go. I'm a... Their text... Is funny. I honestly think they have some of the funniest text. It's just that, or funniest dialogue, I should say. But they're also one of the harder fights. Where is Gargan? Crap. Where is Gargan? What is he doing over there? Gargan, the fight's over here. Ah. Hey Rhino, check this out. Crap. Hey Rhino, check this out. Perfect. That's some good hits on him. On to Gargan. That's some good hits on him. To be fair, he is getting punched. 
Hit Rhino. Mess him up a bit. Ah, it's a good thing I got... It's a good thing Rhino's a heavy hitter because he's doing a great job at hitting Gargan. Is Gargan down? I think Gargan's down. I big, I big guy, follow me. Follow the dancing spider. Okay, not what I meant. Down, boy. Only oh, two tries. That went really smoothly. Octavius will do if he finds out you fail. I failed. Yes, you freak show. A little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. I can't believe that one took me two tries. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sables, man. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. Alright. I have to say, I consider that to be the hardest fight in the game, just because you have the heaviest hitter in the Spider-Man universe. Let's be fair. In, like, in, in Spider-Man's rogues gallery. And you also have to deal with Scorpion at the same time. I realize Norman Osborn claimed he was stepping back from running Oscorp when he was elected. But has he? Or is he using his office, his public trust, to enrich himself beyond imagining? And with threats like Electro, the Devil's Breath Sickness, and who knows what else, has his greed endangered us all? These questions need to be asked. As long as there is breath in my body, I will ask them. They actually are really good questions, and sometimes you truly do remember. Um, Jonah is a good journalist, and he, and he doesn't just take any side that's against Spider-Man. But, yeah. I Like I was saying, Rhino, is, Rhino and Scorpion is probably the hardest fight, just because it's uh, one of the, the heaviest hitter in, Spy, in Spider-Man's rogues gallery. And you also have to deal with... Uh, Scorpion at the same time. So, the fact that I did that pretty smoothly, gotta say, pretty good, in my humble opinion. I'm just gonna, it'll be, it'll, this will make this whole thing so much easier. And I never really showed off. Hey guys, check out the, this electric thing. Bip. 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 Hey look, I got a bunch of crime tokens all at once. It's a... The greatest magic trick I ever performed. And just like that, that was the easiest sale mission I've ever done. Alright, with that all done, thank you all for watching this episode of Marvel Spider-Man. This one might be a bit short, but that's because I honestly expected the the uh, Rhino thing to go longer. If you like this part, leave a like, show you did. If you like, subscribe for more like every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Or check out Lean the Blind, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Uh... And if you didn't like this button for that too, maybe you can leave a comment saying what you didn't like. Maybe it's the fact that, uh, I'm trying to, uh, maybe it's the fact that, uh, I still did, honestly didn't do that well against Rhino and Scorpion, but I can do, I could do better. I could have done one try. 
Follow me on Twitter at the real game hero. Follow my producer at links at links at underscore art. I have been the game hero. And I'll see you all next time. Later's. My injured shoulder eventually healed. The bill took a lot longer to pay. The Spidey Squad, my one and only fan club. When Jameson's going off on me, it helps to remember they're out there.